Alright everyone, well in this video I'll be doing an unboxing and initial look at this AMD Sempron 3850 CPU. Well actually they call it an APU, an Accelerated Processing Unit, only because AMD have put the CPU and graphics into one processor. So it's quad core 1.3 GHz and I purchased it from Amazon for £26. Yes, brand new for £26. And even the motherboards are quite cheap. Because AMD have produced like a, a budget range that they're sort of encouraging you to upgrade in the future. I was just doing some quick calculations earlier and I reckon you could build a whole computer for about £120. £120? Most of the individual components in my computers cost more than that. And mine just boggles at how cheap you could do that nowadays. Let's take a look at it. Firstly, you can see the evolution on the sizes of the CPUs I've bought. 125 watt hex core CPU. I think this one's a 70 watt, 25 watt. So you can see, it's quite a bit smaller because you don't need such a big CPU cooler. So a quick look at the box. Well, that's the side that you can see the CPU through. Just mentions about what it is. Yeah. And a few warnings that I can't quite read very well because they're very small. So let's take a look inside. And it's taped up very well. I can see the spec of it here, so that's 1.3 GHz, quad core of 2 meg of cache. The rest of the information is that it has a GPU frequency of 450 MHz. can support up to the DDR3-1600 on RAM. And the, code, and the code name for the CPU range is Kabani. AM1 is yet another unique socket for the AMD CPUs, which is really annoying. Well, that's the CPU there. There's a one pound coin for comparison. Let's have a look what we've got here. Certificate of Authenticity. Okay. And a few warnings about it. And What's this, the instruction manuals on how to mount the cooler? Yes, because the cooler only has two screws, more like two pins there. That's annoying because if it had been compatible with the AM2 coolers, I could have had a nice fanless CPU. So the CPU will be going in my NAS, so I'll be having a quad core NAS. Well, there it is. Yeah, that fan's pretty small. Taking a look, that's about two inches, that fan, or five centimetres. Here's a suggestion, don't put that face down because the <laughs> CPU paste has just got stuck to my table. Never mind, I've got plenty more CPU paste upstairs. Just as I was packing it up, I noticed this fan is only a three pin, which means it's not speed variable. So that's gonna be running flat out. I'll have to see how noisy it is when I get my system up and running. So let's look at the AMD Sempron 3850 APU. Thanks for watching, see you all later.